Okay, this will be a cool episode because you will participate too. See this photo here on the screen, really cool photo manipulation scene, terraforming robot doing things to the planet, etc. And uh, let me first show you, let me break down how I did it and then I will tell about the challenge. Everything started with a sketch. I took my iPad and used Procreate to quickly sketch out the terraforming robot that I want to create. I split the sketch into three different parts to easily visualize what I will create later in a blender. I transfer everything in Photoshop and use that as a sketch to create this terraforming robot in blender. It looks really cool in my opinion. I could invest even more time to add even more details here, but for this project, for this purpose, I think this is pretty much cool. Okay, after I did that, I went into Photoshop and just started building the scene. This is the pyramids that I want to have in the background. Then I took another photo of a dune, add a layer mask to mask out unnecessary parts, then quickly adjusted the pyramid a little bit and also wanted to just match the colors between the dune and the pyramids, add a little bit of the shadow, change the sky, because it was really dull and flat sky, so I added one photo of the sky, I added another photo of the sky, inverted, to match the position and the lightness a little bit better, and mask out, blend these two photos together later, color corrected, and that's basically it. And also put the robot back into the scene, and use this guy right here that I actually created from four different photos, and uh, reposition it, made it a little bit smaller, added a few spaceships here and there to populate the scene even more and then I added even more details like these rocks right there that I again created into Blender it's really simple and easy process and uh, the idea is that these robots are terraforming the planet they're drilling really down deep uh, through the surface of the planet and a lot of things like rocks and everything are going out also, this is the glow effect that you already know if you're following my tutorials how to create it. It's really simple and easy. I have also a playlist dedicated to that. Then I went into camera, did some final adjustments and color grading. I made the left side of the photo a little bit darker because the right side where the sun is is a little bit brighter. And uh, as you can see, play with the colors here and there. And after tweaking, this is my final result. I really hope that you like this final result. Let me know down there in the comments what you think about this artwork. But now is the challenge time. Before that, let's mention the sponsor for today's video. This episode is sponsored by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of online classes that you can use to improve your current skills or learn some new skills. They have a lot of photography and illustration classes, graphic design, freelancing and much more. For example, you want to step up your photo manipulation game and start learning some 3D softwares like Blender because it's free. Skillshare has some amazing tutorials on how to start Blender, how to model in Blender, how to animate in Blender and much more. Also, they have some great drawing classes and if you're a photo manipulation artist, you know that sometimes you need to draw certain things manually and if you know how to draw, how to sketch, how to shade things, how to draw a hair, an eye, etc. That's really, really important. You will make your artworks even better. And I really recommend Mima's artwork, Beginner's Guide to Portrait Drawing in 19 lessons. She will cover all the basic things and with that class, you will improve your drawing skills a lot. Also, Skillshare is an ad free, so you can stay in the zone while you're exploring new skills. Also, there are new premium classes launched each week and there are so many cool things to learn there. So first 1000 of my subscribers that use the link down in the description or my code Nemanja Sekulic will get one month completely free on Skillshare. So you can see if that's something for you and if you like it after one month, you can just continue with the subscription, which is pretty affordable. Now is the challenge time where you guys are participating. Down there in the description, you have the link where you can download a photo of this terraforming robot that I created in a blender. And the goal is to create any kind of artwork around this robot, to create a story around this robot using any photos that you like with one catch. You cannot use the desert topic. I use it in my artwork. Now you need to be innovative and use your imagination. This is amazing, amazing exercise to practice your imagination and also your Photoshop skills to create a photo manipulation. So use whatever you want. Just don't use desert theme and create really cool story about uh, the robot, terraforming robot and 
the deadline is till the end of this month you can send me your artwork on the email that you can see here on the screen also the email is listed down there in the description and you can also tag me on instagram with the hashtag that you can see right here so it will be easier for me to find your artwork but the primer uh, way of sending me your artwork is via email and like my older monthly challenges I will review all of your entries and announce three 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 uh, best one in my opinion here on my YouTube channel and also I will shout out on my Instagram account so this is a amazing, amazing opportunity to just practice have fun experiment with your skills and everything that you learn uh, by watching this channel and uh, it's really fun so do your best see you really soon bye bye